In this video, I will show you how easy it is to manipulate the shoulder dart of a two dart bodice block into the side dart. The block with the side dart is the base of drafting the bra top foundation. So before any contouring process takes place, we first need to manipulate the dart. And if you want to see the tutorial on the bra top foundation, the link is in the description box below. I commit to upload videos every Sunday, so please make sure to subscribe and if you already have, thank you so much for being here and for supporting my channel. What we need for dart manipulation are the pattern paper, the ruler and tape measure, the pencil and eraser, some color pens, the two dart bodice block, and some paper scissors. First, we need to mark two and a half inches from the base of the armhole. Place the pattern paper underneath and trace around the perimeter of the block, making sure to stop at the mark that we've just made. With the pen pushed to the bust point, we rotate the block to close the shoulder dart and we continue tracing making sure to stop again at the same marking. Here I am using a pencil to draw the side and waist dart as these are just temporary legs. Measure one inch away from the boss point and start redrawing the dart legs. The reason why we're doing this is to avoid sewing our bodices, you know, with the pointed bust. We want to avoid that. And it is also important that we have the legs of the side darts uh, of the same length and same goes with the legs of the waist dart. For the chevron shaping of the side dart, score one leg and take it to the other, just like so, and use a paper scissors to cut along the side. The block can now be transferred into a heavier weight paper or folder which we can just pull out at any time and there is no need to create a block every single time. 
This is how you manipulate a shoulder dart of a two dart bodice block into a side dart. 